Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shannon and it is Mask Monday. I am doing a, a Mask Monday with Connie from up north, my sunshine sister. And this mask is super thin, so it looks like I don't even have one on. This mask was sent to me and Connie got one as well um, from our wonderful, gorgeous, amazing friend, Barbara's Beauty Bags. She sent us this amazing tomato brightening mask by Curette. I have been dying to try this and there is quite a bit of like serum left in there that I keep. I save and then I use them to rub on my face for later, so I am super excited about that. I am going to be using my Tona Sculpting Bar right here as we do some, I do some questions. We, me and Connie are doing the same questions. So um, our questions that we decided to do since it is close um, to Mother's Day, Mother's Day was just yesterday. Um, we wanted to do random mom facts for our mask one day and random mom facts for, um, me and Connie being moms. Um, we did our collab, um, with the Cheesy Chicks and that had, um, uh, we did a flower look for our moms. I did a, um, Kella Lily and so um, all of that will be linked down in my description box below so we decided to do ourselves you know like I said as moms random mom facts so without further ado um so the first one was how old were you when you became a mom and I was 19 when my son was born so um you know, that does seem very young, but, um, you know, the older you get, the younger it seems. <laughs> but, um, I was very young when I became a mom, but I wouldn't change it for anything in the whole wide world. Um, the next one is, sorry, my mask is, uh, dripping here. There we go. Uh, the next one is, how many children do I have? I have one one son and he is my whole world he is uh, the most amazing human being on the planet in my opinion and um who are your children my son his name is brendan and uh, brendan is the light of my life the love of my life the love of my heart the one that completes my soul you know as any mother speaks of their children um he is my everything and how old are your children? My son is 23 and he will be 24 in December. Um, where are your children from? Um, my son is from Oregon, same as me. I'm born in the same small town I was born in. So um, that's, you know, super exciting. <laughs> and let's see, um, how did I come up with my child's name? So I found Brendan's name in an article um, in Playboy magazine. Uh, they were doing a write-up on Brendan Fraser for The Mummy. And um, I really, I, I absolutely loved the name Brendan. And um, I wanted it to be spelled different than Brendan Fraser was. Uh, he spells his with an A in a N at the end and my son is E N and um, I just absolutely fell in love with that name and um, his middle name is Walker and that is a family name on his dad's side and so that really meant a lot to his dad to be able to um, have him carry on that name which um, after we picked his name it was Brendan Walker and I just thought that sounded like a perfect you know small boy's name and you know when he grew into be a man it was you know a, a good fitting man's name so um, yeah and let's see here favorite meal my child likes me to cook so my son knows that I am not a good cook <laughs> he will tell you I am because he's so sweet um, but yeah, I can't cook very good. In fact, he is a phenomenal cooker, um, but, um, or a phenomenal cook. Um, I, 
uh, he would probably say that when I make like uh, tacos, burritos, something super simple, um, fried chicken, he loves fried chicken, uh, that would be probably what he would say his favorite meal is that I make. Knowing that I cannot cook very good, but again, like I said, he will tell you I cook just fine and that's not true. <laughs> and let's see if your children are old enough what do they do for a living my son works in a production line for a hemp plant and it is something he absolutely loves he is also a carpenter by trade so he builds houses and does drywall and roofing and windows and he is phenomenal at it he did drywall work for me after I had some plumbing issues at my house last year um, he has helped, you know, lots of family members, you know, put roofs on and windows in, and he's absolutely terrific at that. But um, right now he's working as um, one of the main machine operator at the hemp um, plant that he works at. And what's your favorite memory with your child? Oh my gosh, my son is a phenomenal baseball player. He's phenomenal at sports in general, but he is a phenomenal baseball player. And so I adored watching him play all the way from, you know, the little, little guys and t-ball to the minor league to the major league to the all-stars to middle school to high school. I absolutely adored watching him play baseball all sports but baseball was just something that was very special with me and him um and we traveled a lot to go um on lots of sporting stuff uh another good time was when he won the hoop shoot championship it was this elks uh, the elks company the elks clan whatever you call it um had a hoop shoot championship so it's a free throw and he beat out um, like three over 3,000 kids in the first one, went to the regionals and beat out, I don't know, 5,000 more kids and went to the next stage and then was like two baskets under going to state. So just all has to do with sports. And we always had just such a fun time. You know, sometimes we didn't have as much money as others, but we always made it a fun time. We'd pack our lunch instead of going out to lunch, but just watching him play sports was is definitely some of my most amazing memories um uh, with him as a as a child so um and do your children have children my son does not have any children yet he is getting married in just a few weeks uh, he's getting married in june to an absolute amazing gorgeous wonderful girl who i get to call my daughter and uh so you know the little pitter patter of small feet i'm sure will be soon to follow um and where does my child live my child lives in the town i just moved away from so it's a couple hours away from me not too far but still kind of sad that we're not in the same town and um so yeah he lives two hours away and if they live far away do you have planned visits and if so what are the visits um we do have lots of planned visits in fact he was just up here for mother's day and um i'm going down in a couple of weeks uh it'll be right before my birthday to see him and then uh, of course for the wedding we'll be together and um then they're going to come up after the wedding and we're going to go into uh you know into the bigger city and go sh uh, shopping and you know have some fun stuff to do so that is our uh, random mom facts i'm going to take this off because it is starting to come off um but that is an amazing amazing mask i am absolutely loving that mask that feels super hydrating uh just super amazing thank you miss barbara and i did wear my little ribbon that she had included in there so i could tie my hair up with it um but yeah getting back to my son he is truly um my hero in life he is the strongest um most amazing person i know outside of my dad and my mom um but he is truly my hero in every sense of that word so um yeah i love you brendan very very much if you're watching this 
And um, yeah, that's all I have for you guys. Um, I hope you guys all have a fabulous week starting off with Mask Monday. I hope you guys have just an uber amazing week. I hope it's fantastic. I hope you guys are kind to one another. Make sure that you check out me and Connie from Up North Live. It will be today, Monday the 9th of May at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. And we are going to draw for our giveaways that we have. She is going to draw and I'm going to draw. So two chances to win. Um, and we're going to do that live with y'all. So make sure to check that out. We had an absolute blast when we did it last week. Um, also, uh, be sure to check out my video. I will have posted it last night on the 8th for who won my last week Monday, Mask Monday collab. Um... I am super excited, not going to tell you who it is, but you'll have to watch it. I will link that video down below. And um, yeah, just uh, there's gonna be, I'm gonna be drawing for another um, winner of my third giveaway I have going on on Tuesday tomorrow. So make sure to check those out. Um, I love you guys. I think I got the dates right. Yes. Tuesday the 10th. So, um, I love you guys. Thank you so much. Have a great week. Be kind to one another and until the next one. Bye.